Hi everyone! Happy Pentecost Sunday! And since it's Pentecost, it means Happy Birthday! Yay! By the way, I'm Ilaw and this is Light from the Light. So why did I greet everyone a happy birthday? Because you see, Pentecost is the celebration of the descent of the Holy Spirit upon Mary and the Apostles. And it also marks the birth of the Church. Yay! So that means what? 1,984 years old na tayo. Grabe, ganun na tayo katanda, we're so old, and yet, we're still strong. Pero teka, 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 teka. How did it become the birth of the church? Remember, during the ascension, Jesus told the disciples to go to all nations and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. However, hindi ka agad yung ginawa ng mga apostles. Bakit? Kasi Jesus also instructed them to wait muna. So punta lang sila sa Jerusalem at maghintay lamang doon. That's why pag binasa natin yung, yung book of the Acts of the Apostles, we would see that the disciples really just, you know, naghintay lang. And on, on that particular day, which is what we are celebrating now, dumating ang Espiritu Santo na parabang tongues of fire sa kanilang ulo and that began everything that started everything after that day, they started proclaiming they started evangelizing so yun, that's why it's also the birth of the Catholic Church now, you might ask bakit Pentecost? why is it called Pentecost? you see, the term Pentecost came from the Greek word Pentecoste, which means 50th, ikalimampu kasi Ito yung ikalimampung araw after ng resurrection. So from the time ng resurrection until the day that, that, that the Holy Spirit descended upon the apostles, merong 50 days doon. Ganun lang siya kasimple. Pero you know, during that time, hindi pa talaga siya tawag na Pentecost. So naging Pentecost lang ang tawag dyan nung lumalaganap na ang Kristyanismo. Pero during the time of the apostles, nung araw na, na bumaba sa kanilang Espiritu Santo, there was really a feast that is being celebrated uh, in Jerusalem that time. And it's called Shavuot. I don't know if I pronounce it correctly because it's in Hebrew, but it's also called the Feast of the Weeks. Ito yung pista ng mga Hudyo kung saan sinicelebrate nila or inaalala nila yung pagbibigay ng Diyos, ng Panginoon, ng, ng Torah kay Moses sa Mount Sinai. So this is a very, very parang grand celebration sa kanila. So talagang pista pista siya na ang daming pumupunta sa Jerusalem. Jews from all over the world of that of that time pumupunta doon. That's why remember in the book of Acts, ma- makikita nyo, mababasa nyo, na there were thousands of Jews and when Peter proclaimed proclaimed Jesus, when when Peter made his speech, nagulat sila, naririnig nila si si Pedro sa kanilang sariling salita and they even thought na baliw siya, pero hindi siya baliw. Sabi niya, it's because of the Holy Spirit. And that day, ang dami kagad na baptize at naging mga Kristiyano. So, anong, anong ibig sabihin lang natin ito? Anong magandang reflection sa atin for this day? Una, we should wait. You know, sometimes we are eager to do what Jesus wants, what God wants, what God wills for us. But then, we, we don't realize na it's His plan, it's His will. And we should wait for the right time na sabihin niya sa atin na go, eto na, ganyan. And second, we should always trust the Holy Spirit. Remember, the church has been standing now technically for 1,984 years. Sari-sari ng mga, mga iskandalo, mga issue ang pinagbabato sa simbahan. And yet, bakit hanggang ngayon nakatayo pa rin? Kasi, simula noon, hanggang ngayon, the church has always been guided by the Holy Spirit. Kaya kung meron man tayong naririnig ng mga batikos, may naririnig ng mga skandalo, Ano lang natin yan? Parang shoulder shrug lang. Mas pagsantabi lang. Habayaan lang natin dahil lilipas din yan. Bakit? Kasi hindi tayo matitibang. Kasi tayo ang simbahan na itinatog ni Kristo. Tayo ang simbahan na, na ginagabayan ng Espiritu Santo. And when God is with us, who can stand against us? God bless everyone. Happy Pentecost Sunday. And again, happy birthday! Yay!